right, you guys. So today we are starting out the vlog here at the Family Thrift Center. It is like five minutes till it opens. We're gonna see if there's any fire today. It looks like there's not that much people here. So we're gonna be one of the very first ones in. All right, so first you guys, I'm gonna show you that I did find this one hat. We got the Baltimore Ravens. Um, it's a really clean hat, actually. It says the NFL 47. I don't know too much about the football hats, but my brother does. He's not with me today. But either way, I'm gonna cop because it's only 191. Next, we got this really sick AFI tee. It's got the AFI with a little devil right there. And on the back, it says the Despair Faction. All right, next one we got here is this Denver Broncos crew neck. It is really clean. Uh, we have the Denver on this side, the Broncos on the other. Uh, this is my brother's team, so I'm gonna go ahead and take this for him. It's Guns N' Roses tee. Uh, it is a World Tour 1992. Down's a really sick print right there. Um, it is an XL, so it's a little too big for me, but this is gonna go on the page, so if you're not following Rare as Fuck Brand, on Instagram, make sure you go follow because this will be for sale. Guys, we found a billionaire boys club crew neck. Dude, what the fuck? How the hell? Look at this. Super sick. We got the billionaire boys club right there on the side. And of course on the front and on the back. That is crazy, guys. I cannot believe I found it. This totally made my morning. I'm so glad I decided to stop at the trip. Yeah, buddy. Hell yeah, guys. I am super hyped on the phone. All right, guys. So we just pulled it to a Texas thrift. Obviously, we're going to look for the gems. Yo, what the hell? Is this Gingy from Shrek? All right, so we got this really cool vintage M&M's jacket. So even if your little ones are into the vintage style, you know, we got it. Definitely going to have to cop size 4T. Let me know. You can get all the colors with the M&M's on the inside. Really sick. Next piece I found was this tie-dye Aerosmith shirt. I uh, also got the tie-dye on the back. Yeah, we're back over here by the diapers because Lori had to come check them out. Oh yeah, yeah. You ran out already, right? <laughs> we found, oh, you wanna show them the bag I found for you? A little nice Victoria's Secret bag, Fifth oh. Avenue, New York. The colors on it are so nice. Yo, and to match the jacket, damn, I that's like sick. The blanket. Man, I'm gonna cup that for myself. It's only three dollars. That's sick. <laughs> you already know the best candy ever is the m and so. Except the, the peanut ones, yeah. The peanut ones are the better ones. Those are the second best. The crispy ones are good too, actually. Oh, the ones with uh, peanut butter. The red pack? The peanut butter ones. Yeah, those look good. They taste like Reese's Pieces. They're okay, I like them. But... Dang, that's pretty cool. What are the odds? We found an m and blanket and a badass vintage m and jacket. All right, guys, so we just finished eating, left that thrift, and right now, oh. oh and you want to lower it? God damn it, I knew it was going to happen. Yeah, I think so. What the hell? This is like the first Walmart I've ever seen today. Yeah, and I have this now, because <laughs> y'all bitches like to steal. <laughs> of course, the one on the south side, right? Yeah. Yeah, because I used to work at this one, and I swear, like, almost every night we'd have someone trying to steal shit. Man, I swear this brings back so many memories. I used to eat lunch over there at, like, 3 in the morning. All right, guys, so I just put up to San Pedro Park. Yeah, work has just been so hectic. I haven't had any time to skate. Probably have, the last time I skated was probably like a month and a half ago. All right, I'm gonna see if I can make this jump real quick. Oh, shit. Still a little chilly out here, real fresh. Nobody's here. Y'all already know just the way I like it. Cause y'all know I'm antisocial. I like skating by myself. And that's when I do my best, but. Anyways, we're here guys. But yeah, I used to come here all the time when I was like in high school. But, I mean, like I said, I haven't been here in like so long. You know, I wanted to try something different today. I haven't been here in a while. All right, I'm not gonna lie to y'all. The only reason why I came here was to skate this little rail right here. Because my plan today is trying to learn a couple new tricks. I'm, I'm gonna warm up and do the same tricks I usually do, but I wanna try and learn something new. 
because the reason why is because this is a little baby ass rail like the rail i used to be here was actually a good legit rail like it was you know it's a good size it's a good length and everything this one's this one's real tiny like y'all know those ones i sell at academy or walmart the little red rail the little red tony hawk rails that's what this rail is pretty much to me that's what it kind of is but i mean i guess it's kind of a good thing you know it's a good rail to like learn some new tricks but i mean i don't know we'll see it Yeah, I know. I admit it. It's my fault that I got smacked in the nuts. For talking shit about that rail, the board did not only hit me under my leg, it also hit my right ball. And I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty sore right now, so I had to go ahead and take off. But I mean, other than that, I had a pretty good sesh. Um, I started trying a couple new tricks, stuck both of them, so hopefully I can come back and land those tricks. But yeah, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and head out already and end the vlog right here. I hope you all enjoyed. If y'all did, please hit that like button, leave a comment, share, hit that subscribe button if you aren't subscribed. And I will see you guys for the next video. I'm out. Peace.